Hey guys, Wade Willis here for Wade Reacts uh, for Jujutsu Kaisen episode 10, and this is titled Idol Transfiguration. Uh, super excited about this. We got some new characters. We've seen that this kid who is now being um, groomed by a curse, uh, and this curse can actually turn humans into curses. So we have some crazy stuff going on. Uh, we got the blonde guy with the glasses. He's about to face off with that with that curse. I don't think it's going to end well for him, but super pumped for this episode. I think that a lot of crazy stuff's going to happen. I'm going to have a timer and everything for you guys to follow along. And if you guys haven't already subscribed to my channel, please do. I do tons of anime reactions, analysis, um, anime skits, uh, tons of other things. And if you like the video, leave a like. It helps a lot. So we're getting a flashback of this kid who was getting bullied. Oh my gosh. More things of this kid getting bullied. Or is this him right now? Oh, this is probably present day, actually. I feel like this guy actually made a mistake having the guy close the door. Oh, maybe not. All right, I stand corrected. I thought the kid was going to be able to beat up the guy, but uh, yeah, apparently not. <clears throat> yeah, this is... Uh... I think he's starting to change because he maybe he's getting confidence by being around that curse and he's starting to stand up for himself, which is good. Um, <clears throat> I hope that this kid doesn't completely turn bad, but the humans that he's being exposed to is uh, they're not good people and Again, you can kind of see why he's going down this path uh, where a curse, uh, working with like an evil curse, is app or is um, seems like a good idea to him. So I'm I'm very unsure of what what's going to happen. I feel like he may see in this episode 
all the bad that the curses actually do, but I mean, he's right there. So he apparently turns into a good guy, I think, or maybe they're just trying to get us off the scent. <clears throat> Mm. Is that a finger? This kid's really bright. What the? What? Oh. <clears throat> Oh. It is. Mm. Huh. Hmm. Interesting. Oh my gosh, that thing's alive? Well, I guess it's dead but curse energy is living in that thing probably Oh 
Oh my god. <clears throat> <laughs> well, we know he's going to at least be able to see it, but the question is, does he have a cursed object? Oh no. I don't get why they, like, they should probably get back up. I know he was trying to save the student, but, I mean, this is a situation you probably need someone else strong as hell to come in, too. Hmm. That is such a good question. Mm. Oh, God.
<laughs> Dude, this guy's so funny. Oh my god. Yeah, how would the teacher think? I mean, you shouldn't kill the teacher. Man, I'm really worried this dude's dying. This would be the most annoying curse to deal with. Oh my gosh, it's so sad. Oh my gosh.
What? Dude, get the hell out of there, dude. Overtime. Oh, man. Dude. <clears throat> Glasses, I am worried about him, man. That is... Uh, I was hoping that once it hit... Uh, what is it? 6.30, he's done. I was hoping that he would just run away. Because I feel like he has a no chance against this Frankenstein-looking dude. So, oh, I'm... A bit unsure about that. Um, overall, another good episode. They don't have any... They have not had a bad episode yet. Um, I guess a showdown with the Frankenstein guy is probably going to be the next two episodes. Um, I, dude, I have a feeling this blonde dude's dying. Don't tell me if you've read the manga, if I'm right or not. But uh, I have a feeling Homie is dead for sure. But... <clears throat> I don't know. I'm, I, uh, this wasn't my favorite episode so far, but I think it's cool how they're showing this stuff with the, uh, one student who's, I think he's been awakened somehow. I, something's going on with the Frankenstein guy and him other than them hanging out and stuff. But I think he's been given powers of some sort or had his powers awakened somehow. So I'm, I'm intrigued to see how that works out with him. Um, and then we got the Juju Stroll. God. Yeah, guys, uh, overall, great episode. I am excited to see how the MC and this new character who has gone through uh, horrible like human experiences and stuff um, where he's just been bullied and all of that, I'm excited to see how they match up uh, based on the opening, which I think Alex pointed out to me that he's in the opening like hanging out with the MC. I guess that he turns to the good side, um, but I feel like there's going to be an interesting path, and uh, they're getting into a lot of deep stuff here with this villain, uh, the main Frankenstein guy right now, and uh, the kid who has been bullied because he's seen all the horrible things that people can do and experienced it, and that cursed guy 
he can manipulate people's souls. So we're kind of getting into um, like, are do people deserve to be saved? And like, what is the soul and what it means to have a soul and like all of that stuff. It's pretty, some pretty interesting concepts that they're getting into, but yeah, this show's awesome. I'd love to know what you guys thought about the episode. Uh, let me know in the comments below guys.